Paris is a city that should be on everyone's travel bucket list. Known for its iconic landmarks such as the Eiffel Tower, the Opéra Garnier, Notre Dame Cathedral and the Louvre Museum, Paris has something for everyone to enjoy, day and night. However, Paris is not the only place worth visiting in the region. Versailles is a magnificent palace whose architecture and gardens are breathtaking, and Disneyland is another popular attraction that both kids and adults can enjoy. In this video, I will provide you with tips on how to make your journey to Versailles and Disneyland as smooth and hassle-free as possible. So sit back, relax, and let's get started! From Paris to Versailles, there are many transport options. You can take a taxi or Uber, get on board a bus, or choose to take the train. Depending on where you take it and on the traffic, a taxi would cost in between 35 and 55 euro, and a Uber free now Bolt would cost around the same. The bus is the cheapest solution. The cost is only 1T plus ticket, 2 euro 10. Take the 171 bus at Metro Pont de Sèvres, which is the last station on line 9, and exit at Chateau de Versailles after 30 minutes without traffic. There are three train options to choose from, depending on where you are staying in Paris. This train, regional train line L, goes from Gare Saint-Lazare in Paris to Versailles Rive Droite station. It takes 35 minutes and costs 4.95 euro. Just make sure to take the train that goes to Versailles Rive Droite, as there are three branches on line L. When in Versailles, you'll have to walk 20 minutes or 1.4 kilometers to the palace. The second train option is regional train line N from Gare Montparnasse. It takes 25 minutes and costs 4 euro 5, but you still have a long 1.5 kilometers or 25 minute walk to the palace. The best solution by train is the RERC, which links seven stations in Paris to Versailles Chateau Rive Gauche, the nearest station to the Palace of Versailles. It takes 25 to 43 minutes depending on where you board it and costs 4 euro 5. From Versailles Chateau Rive Gauche, the walk is then only 900 meters or 11 minutes. Convenient, fast, cheap, and close to the palace entrance, RERC to me is the best solution to go from Paris to the Palace of Versailles. And do not forget that if you have a Navigo Découvert travel card with a weekly or monthly pass, then you won't have to pay anything, as Versailles being in zone 4, the journey would be included in your pass. The same goes for the Paris Visit cardboard ticket, 1 to 4. Now, how do we go from Paris to Disneyland? A taxi between the center of Paris and Disneyland would be quite expensive, between 60 and 90 euros. Without any doubt, the best solution is to take RERA. From five major stations of the Paris Metro, you can take the RERA to marne la vallee chessy which you will reach in 35 to 50 minutes. From the marne la vallee chessy RERA station, you are just 4 minutes, 350 meters away from Disneyland Paris entrance. And only 3 minutes, 250 meters away from the Disney Studios. The RER ticket to the magic of Disney will only cost you 5 euro from any metro station in Paris. If you have a Navigo Découvert travel card with a weekly or a monthly pass, then you won't have to pay anything, as going to Disneyland would be included in your pass. If you want to know everything about the Navigo Découvert card, don't hesitate to watch the video I made about it by clicking on the link here at the top right.
I really hope you enjoyed this video and that it will be useful for your stay in Paris. If so, don't hesitate to subscribe to Paris Top Tips. It will allow me to make many other equally useful videos. Thank you and see you very soon on Paris Top Tips.